Day as a kid. I always loved playing sports. Ever since I was a kid, I've been playing outside with my friends, cousins, and my brother. More specifically, we all loved to play hockey. We loved all forms of hockey, from playing it in the basement, in the rink, in a video game, to playing it outside. I was lucky enough to have a hockey rink in my backyard as a kid, which happened to be the best memories of my childhood. Of all the times I played on that rink with my friends, we would get into a lot of arguments over stupid things. This story may be about the stupidest argument I or anyone has ever gotten into. My cousin Brady and I always played together. However, I always had the edge when it came to hockey. Brady had other strengths. He was a genius and always had me in school. He could solve a math equation faster than I could pull out my calculator. But when it came to sports, that's where I shined. One day, Brady and I decided to mess around and play a game on my rink. Usually, I would give Brady some sort of handicap to make the game more fair. I would say something like, okay, let's play up to 10, but Brady, you get to start with eight. Well, I guess this particular day, we must have gotten into a fight or something because I stared at him and said, let's just play. No handicap, I'm gonna kick your butt. Since we were both pretty young, obviously, Brady couldn't just drive over to my house and play. So my aunt drove him. My mom and her stood in the kitchen watching her boys go at it. Fast forward about 30 minutes, and from my mom and aunt's point of view in the kitchen, they must have thought we were about to kill each other. They were probably worried we were going to disturb the neighbors, so they ran outside. My aunt begrudgingly asked what we were fighting about. First, a little rule in hockey was that the puck had to be completely over the line to count as a goal. It couldn't be halfway over or three quarters over the line. No, it had to be fully over it. Anyway, we told my aunt that we were arguing whether Brady's shot had gone in the net. He was yelling, the ball went in, mom, it went in. I was shouting, no, Aunt Abby, the ball needs to completely cross the line. It wasn't over the line. She got her thoughts together and said, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, calm down, boys. What is the score? That's when I said, 32 to nothing. My aunt furiously yelled, God damn it, Luke, just give him one, and slammed the door. I wasn't happy about it, but I gave him one.